guys good morning guys welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel or you're seeing my face for the very first time thank you so much for tuning in my name is Maureen Ash. I'm a food family and lifestyle vlogger I live in the United Kingdom I live in Bristol precisely welcome to my channel yeah so guys today you've already seen the title you guys CME is a Nigerian food vlogger. She's a Nigerian YouTuber living in Lagos. So there's this challenge that has been trending now. She challenged everyone, both YouTubers and non-YouTubers, to kind of cook in their home with 1,500 in Nigerian money in Naira. So guys, I live in the United Kingdom in Bristol and honestly, I won't even lie, I have never thought of even cooking with three pounds because 1500 in nigerian money if i want to convert it to pounds it's going to be three pounds i have never never thought of cooking with three pounds but i thought about this and i'm like can this actually be done you guys my little boy is here obi is here you want to see everyone okay guys obi wants to say hi to you guys well, come come on come on boy yeah say hi to guys Say hi guys, how are you all? So guys, yeah, I have never thought about it. Sorry, baby. Sorry, baby. So yeah, guys, I have never thought about it, but when I saw this challenge trending, I started thinking, what can I actually really make in my house with 1,500, with three pounds? I thought about so many things that I can actually make with 1,005, which is three pounds, and I knew that I can't go to the African shop, honestly. I just don't want to risk it to the African shop. So guys, this morning, I dropped off my daughter in school and I went to Lidl because Lidl is very close to her school. So I went to Lidl and I bought what I could with three pounds. You guys already saw the clip of the things I bought, but I'm still going to show you guys and I'm going to show us the receipt because I have the receipt here. So yeah, let me get the receipt because I put the receipt in my pocket. So yeah, this is the receipt. For the things I got. Okay. Okay, yeah. So guys, I bought the brown rice. I bought this brown rice. I bought this brown rice for 79p. So this is long grain brown rice. Easy to cook. I love it. I've been eating it. Ever since I started my weight loss, I've been eating it and everyone in my house likes it. Even though this is not the rice that we eat normally, but because I'm on a weight loss journey, I started eating this and I've been liking it so much. I got this chicken stock cube. I got this chicken stock cube for 36p. Okay, so this is about 12 cubes. I've been using this to cook. I use it once in a while, you guys. If you, you can try it. I bought it for 36p. I've been using it and it's also very good. Even though I even though I use a normal Nigerian nut seasoning, sometimes I also use this and this one is also very good. So you can try this if you like. Try it. It's so so good. 6P. So yeah, the next thing I'm going to be showing you guys is the chicken wings. So I got chicken wings. All of these chicken wings. I got it for £1.49. This is 1 kg of chicken wings. So yeah, so the last thing I got you guys is this shop tomatoes the Fresh owner tomatoes is the last thing I got and I got this for 35 So yeah guys, I'm going to go straight into the kitchen right now and start making this food because this is going to be our lunch So far, these are the things I was able to get with three pound two pound ninety nine Let's get into the kitchen and make this meal so guys this is what my list looks like everything i got i got to two pound 99 so guys a pack of this long grain rice is about five cups of rice so i'm just going to take three cups for my family so i'll quickly take this put in the pot add some water and you know cook it and then after about 15 minutes i'm going to just wash it out by then it will be a bit soft you guys this rice is really really different from the normal rice that we eat so the preparation is a bit different and it cooks for a longer time it's not just that kind of rice that you you know boil for five minutes and then wash it off so i always allow it to cook for at least 15 to 18 minutes and then i then wash it out so once i wash it out i'll set it aside
so guys from my kitchen i got this crayfish you guys this is native rice and it has to be sweet and yeah i have this one on onions and i divided it into two i'm going to use one of it to season the chicken and the other one to fry and i have this squash bonnet pepper just one of it i got some salt from my kitchen i got some seasonings i have the curry and thyme seasoning and then all pepper seasoning and then i have this one no cube that i got from the pack of you you guys saw the one i bought earlier yeah i got one of it that one is enough i have some palm oil then this freshness tomatoes you saw when i got that so yeah first of all i'll add the chicken in the pot and i'm going to add half of the onions which i already sliced and i'm going to add a little bit of seasonings and half of the no cube and i'm also going to add some salt and i'll stir this i'm not going to add any water yet i'll just stir it cover it and allow it to cook for at least four minutes after four minutes i'm going to add some water just to you know have my stock to prepare this meal so yeah So yeah, the next thing is just to blend this freshener tomatoes. I don't want to use it this way. I like it to be very smooth. So I'm going to pour this in my blender and blend it and set aside. Then the next is to, you know, slice the remaining half of onions that I already have. I'm going to slice that and also set aside. So at this time, it's about another four minutes and the chicken is done. I don't want it to be too soft. So I'm not going to cook it for too long. So I'm just going to remove this. And then I'm going to line my oven pan, you know, I'll just line my oven pan and then add this chicken into my oven pan. I've not preheated my oven, so I'm going to set it aside while I preheat my oven at 180 and I'm going to grill the chicken. Yeah. Please, and in the same pot, I'm going to, you know, put this on the gas add some oil some palm oil this is about two spoons of tablespoons of palm oil i'll add that and i'm not going to bleach it i'll just allow it to heat up a little while i add the onions to fry for about two seconds so once i add the onions i'm also going to pour in the tomatoes and i'll allow this to fry for at least 10 minutes just to get the salt test of the tomatoes out guys right now my oven has preheated so i'm going to put the chicken wings inside the oven and allow it to grill back to my tomatoes so right now i'm still stirring it so i'm going to do this for like i said earlier i'm going to do this for 10 minutes so after 10 to 12 minutes you guys it is no more salt so i'm going to add the remaining seasonings that i have and then i'm also going to add half of the no cubes that i have left and yeah also guys not forgetting the chicken wings look at the chicken wings very well grilled and it looks good so i'm just going to cover this and set it aside while i continue cooking so at this point you guys the sauce is so ready look at that and the aroma is so good and it tastes really good so i'm just going to pour in the chicken wing stock and i'm going to add my pepper the scotch bonnet pepper you guys in this house we do not eat pepper i'm the only one that kind of even manages to take pepper you know so yeah i'm just going to put put in this uh, the scotch bonnet pepper and i'm also going to add half of another cube no cube just to make it more tasty and yeah i'm going to do that and then the next thing i'm going to do is to add i'm going to add a little more water and i'll test for salt and you guys salt is just okay everything is okay at this point so yeah i'm going to pour in the rice pour in my crayfish this is about two tablespoons of crayfish so that so guys the good thing about native rice is that it doesn't really require much if you have your crayfish you have your pepper and your non seasoning honestly like your native rice is just good to go and one thing i like about this whole green rice is that you won't really think it's uh, a brown rice it tastes almost like white rice so it's also good for this native rice try it out if you want to it's so so good and yeah i already have a 
video on how to prepare native rice a detailed video so i'm going to put a link of that on the description so guys once i do this i'm going to add a little more water and i'm going to stir it and i'll cover this and allow this to cook for at least 15 minutes after 15 minutes i'm going to come and check to see what it looks like so i'm going to cover with a foil paper yeah and i'll reduce my gas to at least uh, medium heat yeah so guys after 15 minutes look at what we have the aroma is so good i'm just going to stop this voice over and you guys will just hear directly from me when i was cooking You guys this is so ready this is so ready and the aroma is good like the aroma is good so i'm going to pick up my daughter from school once i come back we're going to eat wow this is so good guys so so good okay guys so i just finished sharing this and this is the leftover i have this is still almost half of it and i have three chicken wings here even though i ate two while i was sharing so yeah this is for kaima this is for kaima kaima loves chicken wings and she's going to finish that i, I have to add like three pieces for her and this is for me you guys yeah this is for me and then this is for hobby this is what three pound was able to give me in the uk three pound even though i still use some spices and the palm oil from my house but yeah this went really far like this challenge is so 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 good it made it got me thinking and calculating so well and i'm so proud that i was able to pull it thank you to cc and me for giving me this opportunity to calculate and economize for my family so guys yeah this is it thank you so much guys for watching these chicken wings are yummy very very yummy guys they are so yummy guys and yeah thank you so much for watching don't forget to like this video if you like it share send a comment in the comment section and yeah guys see you guys in my next video bye guys how is it like it?